When it comes to surfing, Canada might not be the first place you think of, but a local filmmaker is hoping to change that with his recently released documentary, Canadian Surfer Movie. A lot of people, especially around the world, and wherever don't know that you can surf in Canada, especially on lakes and stuff like that. My favorite part of the whole film was filming on the lake in the winter for the last two years. Produced by Kelowna resident Carrie Missler, Canadian Surfer Movie tells the story of surfers and surfing culture as they travel across Canada to catch that perfect wave, sometimes in some inhospitable conditions. The conditions at Antlers are extremely cold, uh, lots of snow, lots of ice and wind. Um, you got to have the proper gear to get out there and you can only really stay in the water for a couple hours and then you, know, you got, could get hypothermia. But surfing on the lake is not just possible on those cold, blustery days. A relatively new sport hitting Lake Okanagan is wake surfing. It takes a surfboard behind a wake boat and while wading the boat on one side, a wave is created in which you can surf on. Canada, when we talk about the Canadian surfer, we have the East Coast and the West Coast, and we have a whole bunch of land in between with lakes, and wake surfing's really taken off because it's a simple sport. You're only going 10 miles an hour. You can't really hurt yourself, and uh, a lot of people like it. Another surfing-related sport that is making waves in the Okanagan is stand-up paddleboarding. Bob Purdy has been paddleboarding every day since January the 1st, 2011 to raise awareness of environmental conservation and the planet's limited resources. He started stand-up paddleboarding during its infancy and has seen popularity in the sport rise. And, uh, that's probably one of the biggest differences you would see is the numbers that are paddling in Hawaii and California and places like that. We are catching up to them in Canada, so uh, eventually I think you'll start to see the, the same proportions. Canadian Surfer Movie, meanwhile, premiered in Kelowna recently to rave reviews and it's expected the movie will raise the profile of surfing in Canada really does show how vast the, the country is and the different types of surfing that there are within here. I think most of us like the feel of getting pushed by the wave and we do whatever we can to catch it. We got a long ways here. As we say, when we go surfing in Tofino, it's about a six hour drive to get there where we can just hop in a lake right here and be out in 10 minutes. So it's not quite the same as ocean surfing, but it still gives you the feel. To learn more about Canadian Surfer Movie, visit their Facebook page. In Kelowna, Forgo Okanagan, I'm Marianne Ockel.